so wonderful to meet you all. I saw Mean Girls last night and absolutely loved it. It was oh, pure thank serotonin. You. <laughs> oh, so I thanks, so, dude. One of the things that I love about Mean Girls is that it doesn't give you any easy villains or heroes. Yeah. Everybody is complicated. Even Re even Regina ultimately has a lot more depth and humanity to her. For sure. I'm curious for you. Why do you think it's important that people generally, but young women specifically, need to see depictions like that? Especially when it comes to like women or like non men, um, it, there are so many uh, expectations, um, labels, limitations, whatever you want to call it, uh, put on women and non-men uh, in, in different ways and on different levels, right? Which is incredibly nuanced, um, but, and has its different severities, of course, but I think like the overarching sort of like, um, not one person is one thing uh, is, is important. I also think that like, yes, it's like, you know, a funny and silly movie uh, and, and very sweet. And at the end of the day, like the, like <laughs> HBIC is some like bitchy white girl, like go figure. Um, it's yeah. like, it, she's, she's, she's a little, she's a little complicated, um, being, and they all are, which I think is nice. I like, I love to see everybody's, um, sides. Like if I'm close to somebody in my life, I would love to see what they would call their bad side just as much as I would love to see their good side. I would love to see them stressed, anxious, um, happy, elated, successful, failing, whatever. I think, I think it's important. Um, and it just makes people well-rounded, uh, even if they act like a total bitch. Um, I love a bitch. Me too. I yeah. love a bitch. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, and Gallery, I understand that this was a movie that you grew up absolutely loving. Yes. I'm curious for you, was there a scene or a moment that was especially surreal for you to get to recreate or that you were especially excited uh, to get to bring to screen? For sure. I think the winter talent show dance was, was one of those moments because I stepped onto the set and I was like, Oh my God, I'm, I'm in, I'm in a movie that I have seen thousands of times. Yeah. Um, <laughs> And even though our costumes are a little bit different and the song's different and the choreography's a bit different, it, it's still all in that same spirit and yeah. just felt so close to how I felt watching that scene for the first time. Um, so to be able to do it, it, it was one of those moments that felt really surreal and I, and I couldn't believe that that was my life. Also because it was so late at night and I was, I was in those heels. We, we were all in those heels for an ungodly number of hours. Um, yeah. So at, at that point, you're sort of like, what's happening? Where am I? This is amazing, but also so strange. Oh so my God. I, it was my, very fun. My temper is like not cut out to be like wearing that <laughs> and, to be, and to have that on my person for so long. I just remember like being like, I'm gonna like shoot fire out of my nipples right now. I'm so <laughs> angry. Like, I just like, I cannot. We were in those fucking heels for so long. Yeah. And it was lovely. I love it. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Well, I'm at time, so I'm just going to close out by saying congratulations on a great job. Chris, I, you, you were fantastic oh, as Aaron. I hope you're you. ready to be everybody's ultimate crush. Please. Thank you. I, thank you. You're our ultimate crush. Thanks, guys. We love you. <laughs> Me I especially. Thanks so much. <laughs> More than other people. More than a lot of others. Thank you. Thank you so Bye. much. Nice to meet you.